Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Steel here from Steel and Cree. As always, please remember to subscribe down below to keep up with our new content. Now in today's video, as y'all can see, we have a box. And as awesome as boxes are, and as much as cats love boxes, this right here is a box from none other than the Pokemon Center. There have been a lot of people ordering cards from the Pokemon Center, specifically the bl single blisters from Evolving Skies and getting some insane, ridiculous luck with the pulls. I'm talking like ordering like 20 packs and getting like three alt arts. Like that's usually, that almost never happens. Um, we're gonna go ahead and like show somewhere up here on the screen couple examples of what we've seen ourselves online on Twitter as far as like people ordering uh, from the Pokemon Center, Evolving Skies, and showing their pulls. There are a couple theories about this. Uh, one theory is that in order to get one of these, I guess, God cases, you need to get lucky and have a box sent to you from Cleveland, Ohio, I want to say. So we did get a box, uh, a case of 36 booster packs. But as you can see, it's not from Cleveland, Ohio. It's from Patalaska, Blathamaska, Ohio. Patamalaska? Pass. Oh, baby, oh, baby. Hold on. So for the, I mean, for the sleeved artwork, we got no Rayquazas, and I believe they also have Sylveons, but we didn't get any of them. It's literally just all Umbies and a bunch of Duraldons. All right. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm genuinely nervous right now. We just bought 36 freaking booster packs in the Pokemon Center. Oh God, those all just fell forward. Pack number one. We have zero idea what to expect right now. We had some pretty high expectations with this going into it, but those expectations are tanking as we get our first pack. Code for everybody. Oh man. Let's just, just go through it. Crystal Cave, Lilligant. Okay. Mentioned this on Twitter before, but if we don't get like some dope pulls, oh good Lord, which it looks like we might not. Uh, I, I, I really don't see us uh, ordering more Evolving Skies. It's just such a disappointment. Honestly, Subat and Tropius. The pull rates are just so bad. All right, we got Fire Energy, Tentacruel, Palpitoad, Shopping Center, Cutifla, Applin, Sableye, Nickets, or Tickets. Berg might hit Monchan and uh, regular hollow. Slacking. Poop. Go for everybody. Like. Oh, wow, that's actually kind of cool. We got a reverse hollow slacking. Put that with the regular slacking. All right, we got Psychic Energy, Boost Shaky, Shellgon, Lombre, Slack Off, Flabebe, Carvana, Dwible, Mareep the Sheep, Salamence, seriously? Ludicolo. All right. Code for everybody. So that was pretty dope. Boo shaky, wishy washy. All right. Steel energy. Got a rescue carrier, a crystal cave, Avalug, Flabebe, Swablu, Lit Leo, Chin Chow, Dano, Elemental Badge. Oop. Oh, it's a regular V, isn't it? Sylveon V. All right. You know, we actually do love Sylveon. That's Kree's favorite Pokemon. So not, you know, 
too upset with that. Code for everybody. But man, those Alt Art Sylveons are expensive right now. Zinnia's Resolve Seismitoad. Do we have two Zinnia's? Oh, because one's reverse hollow. Okay, makes sense. I believe it was at Australia at least that bear a confirmed Evolving Skies reprints, which personally sounds like a great thing to me because hope, uh, part of the reason supposedly why some of the Evolving Skies hits are so expensive is because people are saying that it's out of print already or it's no longer being printed. And if there's a reprint, that's definitely going to drive the value of the cards down, which is incredible, which will actually, because it'll actually make them more affordable for all the people that do not have it, which is many, many people. Code for everybody. Let's see. Lightning Energy, Skip Bloom, Flesh Ender, Shopping Center, Lotad, Molga, Wubat, Gossiflor, Vibas, Chinchow. Okay. So. Don't know what this is yet, but it looked like it could be something cool. Uh, alt art, I don't think so, but maybe at least a VMAX. We'll see though. Let's see. It's a VMAX. It's a uh, Trevenant VMAX. Honestly, I don't remember if we have this. Have we ever pulled it? No, but I think we might have won it in a giveaway. Go for everybody. Wobbuffet and Smeargle. Holy moly, code for everybody. All these freaking green coats, fam. I mean, again, there's still a chance that we'll get something dope, but it is not looking very likely at this point. White Code Rayquaza pack, code for everybody. Fighting Energy, Lucky Ice Pop, Scrafty, Snow Leaf Badge, Lily Pup, Amolga, Tentacool, Pumpkaboo, Bag on Petalil, and, oh, not even, it's a Florgus. It's a freaking Florgus. Code for everybody. Uh, nope, nope, I already, it's, it's a freaking Victini. It's a freaking Victini. I don't even think we have this low key, but that's still not exciting. Great stuff. Code for everybody. But we will find out, because we are not done yet. We are not even halfway done. Hold on there. Code for everybody. Psychic Energy, Tether Cool, Cruel, Baldor, Aroma Lady, Psyduck, Eevee. There's definitely a hit back there. I don't know what it is though. Cutie Fly, Pikachu, Applin, Lombre, a uh, Gordy. It's pretty cool because we are collecting full art trainers. But okay, okay. Things are heating up right now. Code for everybody. One, two, three, four. All right, dark energy. Hippodon, Tentacruel, Rubber Gloves, Swablu, C Dot, Woobat, Eevee, Temple, Scrafty, Jump Bluff. I mean, as far as the actual like white code cards, code for everybody, they're like the rates are not that bad. Code for everybody, got a little bit of a peeker. Steel Energy, Fletchender, Shopping Center, Lantern, Phoebus, 
Gossiflor, Love Disc, Fletchling, Chinchow, Lotad, and Duraludon V Regular. Code pack, let's freaking go. All right, Water Energy, Flappy Taffy, Brady Airy, Swishing Cups, Drowsy, Scraggy, Bagon, Woobat, Timpole, Elemental Badge. Ah, it's a Rourke. Good for everybody. Zuelis, Stevel. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten white coats. This is almost 50 50 for hits. Except the hits are garbage. That's that's not that's not nothing right there. That's not a net net nutter. Good for everybody. One, two, three, four. Oh, that was nothing in the back, was it? Nope. Galarian Articuno. Let's see, code for everybody. Like, I'm not trying to pay over $100 for every single Evolution card, because that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Those cards should not be worth that much. They're amazing. Glaceon V regular, not even the V Max or a full art. And all the V Maxes are between like a hundred and fifty and like freaking like five hundred dollars. Might buy them as singles later on when the prices like finally crash. But yeah, they I don't they they should never have been worth that much in the first place. Code for everybody. It might just be a freaking full art though, but I don't know, hold on. Let's see, Dream Ball, Zinnia, Hippodones, something, love this, Dweble, Hippopotus, Wishy Washy, Copycat, Rainbow. I think we need this. Did we buy this already? We'll count this as a hit. We're getting ever so close to pulling the big Yoshi. And by the big Yoshi, I mean an all art. And if you haven't seen Big Yoshi, here's Big Yoshi. He's, um, he's Big. B-E-E-G. Man, check me out opening up all these packs mad quick like I'm a breaker or something. What are you doing? Vote for everybody. Uh, nothing. Code for everybody. Do I bless Miracle? Nothing. Yeah, we're down to like the last like six packs or something. Code for everybody. Still, come on. Fire, bring the fire. Come on. Toy Catcher. Rayhan. Avalug. Love Disc. Dweble. Hippopotus. Zorua. Psyduck. It looks like a regular V in the back. Oh, come on. Please be something good though. <laughs> okay, this is a Neuvern V Alt, and this one is a really, really sick alt art. It, people were calling it like the Batman card. This one, this okay, things are heating up. Things are, things are okay. This is this is starting to get a lot better. Green code. Man, if we got a green code and I just like, you know, showed all the cards and there was like a Evolution all art in there, that would make my week, month, year. Code for everybody. Dark Energy, Bulldore, Aroma Lady, Rescue Carrier, Lotad. Sableye, Teddy Ursa, Mareep the Sheep, Zorua, Tempo, and Espeon V.
code for everybody. Raichu reverse hall is actually kind of dope. That's not looking good. This isn't looking good. Never again with evolving skies. Never again with evolving skies. From the 36, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 were green codes. That should be 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yeah, 15 white codes. Now, as for the actual hits, even though there were 15 hits, we only really actually though got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, I can't count. Literally eight actual hits. And then the rest is just like some garbage. This Neuburn V is really, really nice. And very, very happy to pull that. It was so fun uh, to, you know, open these and experiment and everything and to share all this with you all. Let us know down below in the comments if any of y'all think that Evolving Skies is overhyped or if y'all think that the prices for the cards are ridiculous. If anybody's waiting for these prices to crash. So then you can actually afford some of these all arts. <laughs> let us know too. Um, but as always, we do hope that all of you are staying safe and well. And we will see you all next time.